What is up, guys? Welcome back to another daily build video. This time we're taking a look at the Senna GTR in the racing category. Let's go. Real quick before I get into the video, if you're looking for any of my Motorfest tunes or my Need for Speed Heat builds, I've moved everything to my website. It's militiagamingco.com. There's links in the main navigation menu for Need for Speed Heat builds and Motorfest Pro settings. So click those if you're looking for that. The link to the site is actually in the description of this video. All right, enjoy. All right, first up, let's take a look at the stats for this car. It's a 249 mile power top speed, which is you know, fine for the category, 2.3 acceleration, also great. 15.6 uh, is good for the category and a 1.42 is a little bit on the low side for the racing category, but it does okay. The biggest issue with this Senna GTR is that it's just kind of slow. I mean, it's just not super fast. It understeers a little bit. And because of that, it runs not a great time on my test. So the test course is staying ahead and it ran a 244.88, so that is, you know, it's kind of on the slower side. That being said, I want to take it out to a grand race and see how we do, but here is the tune that I've got rolling on this car. 42% on the brake balance. If we move down to aero, I've got it at minus 20 on the rear. Notice it's an understeer type car, so I'm trying to get it to oversteer. Uh, suspension spring front is a plus 10. Spring rear is zero. Compression front is five, zero on the rear, and five on the rebound front, zero in the rear. And then anti-roll bars, we've got it at plus 10 on both. And camber, we've got it at minus 0.25 on both. All right, let's take it out to a grand race and see how we do. All right, so the Senna's up last on this one. Hopefully I can get a good start. I'm all meted up with the Z4 and the Focus RS in 3.1. So as long as I don't make any crazy errors or get pushed off the track in a crazy way, I should be kind of near the front, hopefully by the time the Senna rolls around. And uh, hopefully we can have a good race. Hopefully the Senna doesn't lose it for us. That's the real question. Try to stay a little wide. Oh, we got a lot of bumping right here. Oh my goodness, dude. We're just going to try to survive this. Oh, we did more than survive, baby. Oh my goodness, bro. There was no point in that. The way he was going into that was full throttle, dude. I'm just gonna, there we go. At least I didn't, at least I didn't fall off. We got Jeremy in the, in the race. So this is gonna be an interesting one. There is a double reset here. If you do it correctly. Oh, I did not. I did not. We're going to try it again. There we go. Oh my goodness. That is the that is the risk with those double resets. If you haven't seen that before, I've shown it on a couple of these videos. It is it is uh tough, man. You really have to be cautious at the angle you're taking the checkpoints and also um when you hit that reset. It's a little bit rough, so All right, we're in recovery mode now. We're setting the Senna up for uh, maybe not not so great a finish, but it's okay. The video is not about the Z4 or my rally raid skills. It's about the Senna. Man, I did not take that corner well, but we're hanging on. We are hanging on here for dear life. The driving skills of me and the rain. That's the issue right now. Oh, we are close to the front. We just need to stop sliding for a second. So we can get so we can get closer. After all of that, I missed the reset. And we're still close. Jeremy has taken a firm lead.
But we're making a comeback, dude. We're gonna blast our Nos right here, and we're also gonna take a pretty risky line through these trees. We'll see what happens here. This line is is very risky, but sometimes it pays off. Today, it might have paid off. Don't hit the bricks. Oh no, I couldn't make the turn in time. The dang understeer of the Z4. Oh, Angel is gaming. Lost control in that, uh, that corner. Sorry, bud. I'm on the inside. But you're more than welcome to help me slipstream up to the front here. That would be wonderful, actually. Okay, dude. You don't have to be aggressive. We're on the same team. We're on team focus. All right, that time I kind of pinched him. Yep, knew that was coming. Oh my god. <laughs> that guy hit the part that was not meant to be broken. And I hit the part that is meant to be broken, and I got lucky. Not gonna lie, I got really lucky. <laughs> All right, Jeremy. I'm trying to track you down. Let's see what we can do. I don't think it's gonna happen. Jeremy is, is too fast, bro. Doing my best here in this focus. Just trying to keep it on the road, dude. I know Angel is gaming is a an inside corner diver. So he'll for sure be diving those corners there. Alright, Senna, let's go, dude. Uh, anytime. Okay. Oh, lost the back end. I literally nosed and accelerated on that and lost the back end. All right, let's let's get let's get to shifting correctly. How about that? That might help this Senna do better. Oh, okay. I took a bad line. All right. So, it's official. The Senna is not the thing that's going to lose it for us. It's 100% me in my driving. There we go. A little better on that turn. Okay, we're getting warmed up. Now, the one thing about the center that I do really like, and I think this is good for most players out there is that it actually does feel very predictable the steering it feels like it's gonna do what you think it's gonna do when it's supposed to do it and that's very important um that's very important to your success in the grand race oh that was my bad my bad i entered that corner way too at the wrong angle now i can't get out of the dirt because of the damn gutter Gutters are my friend, but not in that case. That gutter can... Can F all the way off. Also, I don't like these trees. How am I still in second? That's what I want to know. Forget about trying to catch Jeremy. How am I still in second? Oh, that guy was on the minimap for a second there. We're at 87%. Alright, now we get to see some of the understeer of the Senna. I gotta hit a gutter at some point. 
Oh, we got two. We got two on us right now. 90% ish. Gotta finish, dude. I don't know what racing car they're in. Well, let's just hope that it's uh, nothing that's good enough to beat. Oh, we're, we're definitely hitting the wall on this. Looks like they did the exact same thing. All right, let's just tighten up. 95%. Clean driving is going to take it home for us. He's nowhere on the mini map and we've got pretty much a straight shot. One last turn. And we are good, baby. We got second place. Shout out to Jeremy, one of the Jaeger Hunter boys. He's stupid fast. Didn't expect him to be in this race. If he wasn't in this race, I could be like, oh, the Senna GTR is so good. No, I'm just kidding. Senna GTR is okay. The best the best thing about it is that it's predictable and it doesn't um it doesn't do anything you're not like expecting it to do. Meaning the steering is great, it handles fine, there's nothing like really wrong with it, but it just doesn't excel at anything great. Anyway, give it a try if it's a car you really like. It actually looks quite good i mean it's it's a very nice looking car so if you like driving it it is okay but uh not great by any means anyway enjoy this i will catch you on tomorrow's daily build thank you so much for watching trigger out